Hey guys, another YouTube tutorial. This one's gonna be a little different. It's gonna be on how to get the data files for Balloons Tower Defense Battles. All right, so what we're gonna do is go to my PC or this computer. If you don't know how to get to there, press the start button on your keyboard and I believe the E button. And there we go, it does open it up. Okay, so go to OSC, Program Files. Scroll down until you see Steam and open that. Steam Apps, it's just the same as we did to get the Balloons Tower Defense 5 files. Common. The only difference is this time we're gonna go to Balloons TD Battles. So go ahead and open that up. Go into Assets. Now you're gonna see data.jet. Notice the jet, it's just like Balloons Tower Defense 5. We're gonna go ahead and actually before we do this, Let's copy, uh, go back to the Balloons Tower Defense Battles folder. Right click on Assets. Create Shortcut. And now we're gonna cut this shortcut. Go to your Documents. Go to your Balloons Tower Defense modding file. I'm going into my YouTube folder, but you guys aren't gonna have that. <clears throat> You're just gonna have a regular, that's it. That's your modding file. Go ahead and right click new folder BTDB for Balloons Tower Defense Battles go ahead and paste our shortcut rename it shortcut and go inside of it now you're back into the Steam folder copy the data.jet file go back to your modding folder Paste the data.jet, right click on it, 7-zip, extract here. Oh, a password. This password is going to be a little bit different than the Balloons Tower Defense 5 password. The link will be in the description below and it's also in every single video. Go ahead and paste the password, press OK, and we're good to go. If you're not sure how I am doing this, this program right here is called 7-zip. If you watched the first video in the tutorial series, how to actually mod Balloons Tower Defense 5, you'll see how to download 7-Zip and also how to download Visual Studio Code. Visual Studio Code is a free um, IDE, I think they call it. Uh, basically, it allows you guys to program. And that's what we're gonna be doing. We're gonna be doing actual computer programming to add the content we want. Not like Infinite Money, more like new towers, new upgrades, anything you guys can think of. This is how you get those four, four upgrades that they show you in the videos. Uh, so that's some food for thought. If you don't know how to get those two programs, just go to Google and make sure you download it for the right operating system. And if you have 64-bit or 32-bit. So we're just about done. Any second now. All right, so we're done. Go ahead into your assets folder, JSON, just like all the other modding videos, and look what we have here, everything. We've got access to all of the modding files. We've got the card definitions, the battle card definitions. You can go in here, let's click on two, see what two is. And there it is, it's uh, the dart monkey with the lead, I think. Yep. That would be right. Look at that. Let's go over here. We have the balloon set definitions. Here you can change the amount of balloons that are sent. Like, let's go ahead and open the ceramic group one. Open with code. It costs 450 to send it. The interval is 0.2 seconds in between. I guess there's only one balloon, and you can only unlock it on round 16. Um, editing these files, of course, when you play balloons or when you play battles, then this will change, you know, and then it'll send 100 instead of one, as an example. Go back to JSON, we have the chat packs, I guess these would be the um, emojis. Game mode definitions, we got... Oh, look at that, easy, medium, and hard. Let's go ahead and see what that is. 
A fun fact, they've actually used the majority of the Balloons Tower Defense 5 files for BTD Battles and Monkey City. See? There is no single player, but this is a single player setup. So let's go ahead and go back here. Modes. Look at that. All the modes. This would be fun. This would be fun. What's this? Unlock all upgrades. Mode. Oh, look at that. So that could be a little bit of a cheat right there so you guys can unlock everything in one go. All right, let's see here. Here are the tower definitions when you place down your monkeys. A lot of people talked about adding the Cobra monkey to Balloons Tower Defense 5. All you gotta do is take the files inside of here, paste it over on there and you'll be good to go. Look at that. I mean, of course you're gonna want to edit it just a little bit, you know, because you're not facing an actual person, you're facing balloons. But as you guys can see here, we do actually have everything. This is it. A uh, fun mod idea would be if somebody, and I've seen people do this, they take the tracks, like the maps, and they take them over to uh, BTD5 and vice versa. That would be a fun thing to do. All right, guys. Well, that's the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. If you have any comments or questions, put them down in the comment box below. I'll make sure to include the link to the Discord server where everyone's talking about this stuff and the zip passwords. Emphasis on passwords. There's going to be the passwords for Tower Defense or BTD5, Monkey City, and BTD Battles. And as always, thanks for watching. Bye!